somebody who had, let's say, they have no credit score. Okay. None, zero. Mm-hmm. Let's just say that. How do they? How does a bank determine whether they're going to give somebody X amount of money? They okay. You're not going to so get anything if not, you ain't got you're a credit not going to get it, and this is why. I'm just this is what I'm talking about as far as you're not going to get any, and then actually getting your explanation so you understand. The reason why, if you don't have a credit score, that you won't get any is because okay, I'm in the business of giving out money, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I give out money. I give up to thirty thousand. You're mm-hmm. looking for a fifteen thousand dollar car, right? Mm-hmm. You or no, you in the business of giving out money. That's what you do. So it's not like oh, what I'm giving a fifteen. No, this is actually what you do. I come to you mm-hmm. and I say, hey, I got a car for ten thousand. You want to give your money out to the person who's going to get you your money back, mm-hmm. right? So then you're going to say, okay, Marcus, who have you paid 10000 before to? Oh, I haven't paid 10000 before to nobody yet. But then you got somebody else behind you, right, who paid 20000 They're like, I'm buying one for my son. Mm-hmm. Who you, Would you choose me? Seriously. Right. Like right now, you know me. Would you choose me or would you choose the person that make that Paid off a car before, and he just getting one for his daughter. No, yeah, you get him? absolutely. You with your money, would you choose me helping you with the no. credit? You would no, choose him, right? Yeah, and everything. guess what? Banks have it's literally that exact same scenario, meaning they get deals every single day, so they're not scared to say no to somebody. Uh-huh. They're following their protocol, and they know that they're going to get somebody else who does qualify. So that's exactly how it works. That's exactly the thought process, everything. So that's why if you don't have a credit score, you either need money down or you need a cosigner. Almost period. But if you have a credit score, almost a bad credit score is almost better than no. But it's really not. I wouldn't say that. It's really not. It's just they have nothing to judge it off yeah. of. You follow me? Yeah. You're going in to get a car loan, and they literally have nothing to judge it off of. And then the person comes and say, "I don't want to put money down." Mm-hmm. I mean, the they, they have nothing to do. Now, mind you, if you have an income, mm-hmm. if the income can make the bank feel comfortable. So if I came to you and I told you I make a hundred grand a year, yeah. and I wanted that loan, and then you had a guy, you probably wouldn't pass up on me before getting him. You right. say, you know what? I'm gonna take the you get what I'm saying, yeah, and yeah. that's where that There's income. No, bill, no hey, bills in last month. That's where that income ratio comes. Yeah. Remember the 15? You way over. Mm-hmm. So then that can make up for you having no scores. So, um, yeah, that's um, that's really it. So if you don't, my thing is, and it sounds like it's something you're gonna do. I would um, have you. You got a credit card and anything? Nothing yet. That's good. It, it's good that you're not bad. You get what I'm saying? Because it's right, harder yeah. to come up, but it's just not. Yeah. It don't help. Yeah. So I would bank. Now, don't rule me out because I'm saying this, but I would just bank that you would near Cosana, mm-hmm. but I always like to let them say it. But I would bank. If you don't have a no, one, not one trade line, mm-hmm. your first one, they're not going to give you 30 grand, 32 mm-hmm. grand without no Cosana. Yeah. yeah. Now, a eight grand, a ten grand, or twelve grand, yes, yeah. you get what I'm saying. Yeah, they'll give you a twelve, you know, with no cosigner. You buy right, you know, but thirty thousand, you have to have a cosigner. That's what I would say. I'm not opposed to getting a cosigner. Yeah, and that's what I'm saying. I always tell people people got so much pride nowadays. Because they see all this Instagram stuff, but I'm like, dude, you don't even know how that person bought that. No <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, no you idea. don't know the details, but dude, it don't matter having a cosigner or not. You won't need one eventually. But the people like that usually get in over their head anyway and end up messing their credit and everything else. That's just it. Yeah, you can't tell. You can't tell unless it's nighttime, but it's slick at night. I'm going to buy this car. I don't know when. Yeah. And take like your time, man. Really like tomorrow.